We all know that you shouldn't buy a Mac for gaming, but how does it handle on the occasional game? Let's start out with Counter-Strike Global Offensive. While running the game on medium settings at 2880 by 1800 resolution and a 16 by 10 aspect ratio, my average FPS was in the mid 60s while roaming the map. Once I started getting to gunfights, it dropped to the mid 40s and as low as 35, but it was definitely playable though. Next, I moved the aspect ratio to 4x3, which lowered the resolution to 1024 by 768 and this gave me an average FPS of 100, and the FPS went as high as 130 and as low as 70 when I was getting into gunfights. For me, I would take the lower FPS for a wider field of view because we were already playing on a really small screen. Moving on to City Skylines, it is certainly playable at 1440 by 900 resolution on low settings, and you're getting a smooth frame rate. There are occasions where it can stutter a bit, but it's so rare it's not even a problem. Trying to play at 2880 by 1800 though is a no-go, unless you want to be bald by the end of the night from pulling out all your hair. While it is playable at this resolution, there is little visual difference, and in my opinion it is not worth it to play on low and choppy frame rate like this. Moving to a more populated city with more happening in it, the frame rate can be a bit more choppy on occasion, but it is absolutely playable. If you're just going to be using this for casual games, you're not going to mind the choppiness anyway. If it does bother you, you can always lower the resolution for a few extra frames. Hey boys, and I'm here with my Minecraft Let's Play channel, and today we're going to try to get some diamonds so we can get some obsidian, so we can go to the nether and we can get some blaze rods. That's what we're going to be doing here on episode 352 of my Minecraft Let's Play channel. Finally, we're going to look at Minecraft, the benchmark staple. Playing on default settings, which is a 12 render distance, my frame rate was mostly hanging around 100 to 120 FPS. I was in one area so the chunks didn't have to be loaded, but the FPS went as low as 80 and as high as 150. I then changed my render distance to 21 and while it was playable, I would lower it for smoother gameplay. The frames were hanging around 40 to 60 FPS and while it was mostly smooth, there was a little bit of choppiness, so I moved from 21 down to 16 chunks and I think this is the sweet spot. We were getting a solid 70 FPS with no frame stuttering at all. What are your thoughts on the max gaming performance? Be sure to leave a comment down below on what games you want me to test next and I'll catch you on the next one.